How to make a sword and scabbard out of balloons. Hello and welcome to Video Jug. Balloon modeler extraordinaire Jelly Kelly is going to show us how to make a sword and scabbard out of balloons. Watch Video Jug's How to Start Balloon Modeling before you get started for great tips on technique. Step 1 You will need a 260Q balloon, a 160Q balloon, and a professional pump. Step 2 Blow up. Place the lip of a 260 balloon over the nib of your pump. Inflate the balloon, leaving a 2.5 inch tail. Step 3. Tie off. Loop the lip around your fingers and then tuck it through the loop. Gently pull and release to form the knot. Step 4. Tulip twist. Make a tulip twist for the handle of the sword. See how to start balloon modelling for more information on tulip twists. Step 5. Make the handle. Hold the balloon with the tulip twist pointing upwards. Fold the end of the balloon up, down, and up again so it is folded three times, but there is still about 10 inches left unfolded. Now bunch the folds together, holding each one in the center, and squeeze them together, twisting one side only so that they join with the top of the tulip twist. You will now have three loops. Position them at right angles to the sword. Step 6. Measure the scabbard. Inflate a 160 balloon fully and tie it off. Squeeze it a little to relax it. This will make it easier to wear as a scabbard. Measure a loop that fits around your waist by bringing the knot end around towards the middle of the balloon. Twist together to lock it off. Step 7. Make the loop. Make a bubble in the tail end. Then bring it into the first loop twist and lock off with another twist. Position the bubbles so that one lies on top of the join and the other below it. Done. Place the sword in the scabbard and wear with pride. <laughs>